My name is Stan Doc Sellers, and that's what the Marines called me in Vietnam, was Doc. The reason they did, because I was a Navy hospital corpsman. The commitment of a Navy corpsman to a Marine that's down and wounded is he gives everything for him. He exposes himself to gunfire, to take care of his wounds, to treat him, to give him blood, whether it's to give blood directly out of the corpsman's arm into that Marine's arm with a siphon pump or to give it to him from somebody else's arm. Uh, the Marines, when we went out on patrol, they would uh, sit down, clean their weapons, go through all their ammunition belts and count their grenades, count all their weapons that they needed to carry, uh, make sure all their smoke grenades were attached to their packs right and all like that. And myself, I'm sitting down taking my unit one, which was the medical kit, and I'm opening it up. I'm going through there, counting battle dressings. I'm counting the number of uh, morphine surettes that I have. I'm counting the number of uh, suture material that I have, antiseptics. When I went on patrol, my pack, including my medical gear, my food, and my clothing, and my ammunition and all that I carried was about 85 pounds. I was very scared over there. It's not a time that you weren't scared, but I think that's what made us kind of feel more alive is the fact we were feared for our life and you took advantage of every chance you had to live as much as a human being as you could over there because if you didn't, you'd lose your sanity and war is not pretty. The Marines in uh, Vietnam lost more men there than what was in World War II. A Navy corpsman does not quit. He will take care of that Marine until the end. I think it's important for us to have a monument for the Vietnam veteran because they gave as much, if not more, than any other soldier in any other battle. We had a slogan, all gave some, some gave all. And for that reason, I think that Texas ought to put a memorial up on the state capitol grounds and give us the respect we deserve. All I would like to say to Texans is, please support this monument. We need it. We want it.